गुड मॉर्निंग एंड वेलकम टू यू ऑल टू योर फेवरेट प्रोग्राम नो योर फूड्स इट इज पार्ट ऑफ कुकिंग ताउशो बुद्धा वे कुकिंग लविंगली कुकिंग मेडिटेटिवली ड्यूरिंग दीज प्रोग्राम्स आई स्पीक टू यू अबाउट वेरियस फूड आइटम्स दैट आर रिक्वायर्ड ऑन ए डे टू डे बेसिस इन आर किचन टूडे आई विल स्पीक somewhat on coconut oil and corn oil but remember we are coming to you with the compliments of deep stone grind flour swarna whole wheat flour surabhi and lakshmi brand of coconut oil shri gun brand of spices biryani pulao masala samosa masala and various other masalas himalayan rock salt and deep frozen foods khao to jano wide range of items samosas parathas naans ice creams and sweets first thing i will speak to you about the coconut oil and also a comparative study of coconut oil and corn oil dr caroline dean md natural medicine says Take five tablespoons of coconut oil and call me in the morning. Take five tablespoons of coconut oil and call me in the morning. She says I am always looking for safe natural cures for that multitask in our bodies, and I have found a great one in coconut oil. Doctor Bruce. Fifi in his book Stop Alzheimer Now says that the basic treatment for this devastating condition is simply coconut oil but coconut oil is not simple one of my clients remarked i just read a few things from dr fifi's coconut oil links i knew it was good stuff but had no idea that it was this amazing it is even used for thyroid it must be one close to perfect food i also know that it is a great antifungal treatment it can be used as a skin moisturizer and can treat seizures as dr fifi says on his coconut research site coconut is highly nutritious and rich in fiber vitamin and minerals it is classified as functional food because it provides many health benefits beyond its nutritional contents coconut oil is of special interest because it possesses healing properties far beyond that of any other dietary oil and is extensively used in traditional medicines among asian and pacific population Pacific Islanders consider coconut oil to be the cure of all illness and coconut is considered as the tree of life what kind and how much coconut oil do you take to treat and prevent alzheimers and many other health conditions and treat hundreds of symptoms the dose used in most studies is about 5 tablespoons of coconut oil if you get extra virgin it is better for that very reason i brought we market two varieties of coconut oil lakshmi brand which is very good it is not extra virgin but it is close to that it has a big mouth bottle and it can be put into the fridge section so with the coldness the coconut oil solidifies you can dig out a piece with the knife it is easier to use the knife and with the point of the knife you can get a piece and you can eat that orally which is very important there are many people who have misconception that they should stop using oil or use less oil but you remember 
just as your automobile vehicle requires oil otherwise it begins to squeak so too every cell of your body requires oil but it requires not the trans fat oils which you accustomed to using so that he says that nearly one third of the world's population depends on coconut to some degree for their food and their economy whether coconut palm grows the people have learned of its importance as an effective medicine for thousands of years coconut products have held a respected and valuable place in local folk medicines it is very very important one thing i will share with you along this line about the coconut oil and corn oil and how the propaganda went on vigorously fats 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 we were told so much about fats fats kills fats cause heart disease fats cause cancer very simple the purpose of this article is to break through the junk science we have been spoon fed and bring to light some of the truth about fats american heart association and a sundry of organizations supposedly supporting your health healthy heart since the 50s have been telling us to eat margarine and poly unsaturated oils for good heart health when you follow the money you discover that the companies making these products are the largest supporter of these supposed heart organizations this is a fallacy in 1998 american heart association in the face of overwhelming evidence and the fact that americans can actually now read finally came out telling us to limit our intake of trans fats and main ingredient in margarine which is a health hazard trans fats are also called partially hydrogenated oils they are in all our junk foods and but some food companies are starting to cut back on their use as sales have fallen since the revolution about trans fats began circulating now here is something you might not know heating oils almost all the oils with an exception of coconut oil actually starts to turn the oil into partially hydrogenated oil one more thing you might not know the oil in your stores on those shelves looking golden and clear are already rancid take for instance corn oil corn oil is first squeezed from the corn and filtered this is virgin oil virgin corn oil is not very stable to begin with and immediately starts to oxidize oxidize means break down and turn rancid this is the process of oxidation whenever anything comes in contact with oxygen or the air it breaks down and turns rancid this is why the food turns rancid but when it is frozen the process of oxidation is is removed it cannot oxidize as long as it is frozen there is a still corn mash left over from the process and because of the food industry wants to make even greater profits they are not concerned about your health they go on to chemically extracted chemically extract the rest of the oil found in the mash how they do it they add benzene to the corn mash benzene pulls the extra oil out of the corn the same way when there is a oil spot on your clothes 
you use gasoline that is called dry cleaning you use gasoline and gasoline pulls out the oil from the soiled clothes since benzene is not allowed in foods the oil must be heated burned to burn off the benzene the burning process degenerates the oil and it starts to turn it into trans fat and also oxidizes it and makes it rancid the oils are all mixed together the virgin is squeezing and the chemically extracted oil they are bottled in clay or plastic oh i forgot to mention to you something very important there is a chemical factory just outside of new jersey that makes an oil flavored perfume that is added to the oil so you do not smell the rancidity the oils are all mixed together the virgin is squeezing and the chemically extracted oil in the clear plastic the oil is assaulted by light which further breaks it down so when you finally open that bottle of corn oil it is still smells clean and pure but much of it is already rancid and rancid oil can attack your arteries and have been linked to cancer now let me tell you a little bit about the coconut oil coconut oil is one of the most stable oil you can buy it does not turn rancid easily it does not attack your arteries and because the oil that we are bringing marketing it comes in a blue can so blue color being opaque to the light the light does not decompose the oil or create any problems with it in fact coconut oil is one of the foods western price studies in his journeys he discovered that the coconut has considered by the local population a medicine food he found that those civilizations that consumed coconut regularly had no knowledge of cancer heart disease arthritis and diabetes i will continue to educate you on coconut oil in subsequent programs just to remind you to tune in to this program which is informative and gives you authentic information on various food items the whole wheat flour is very natural and good because the wheat germ is there wheat bran is there and nothing is removed the wheat is not bleached so it has the natural ingredients and naturally good and for that reason you do not have to add baking powder which is rich in aluminum and that causes these trace minerals cause serious health hazards for individuals that is the reason that when we select the products we make sure whether it is spices they have a complete blend of aromatic and basic spices and whenever there is need like for instance when you are cooking the meat items specifically fish you need fennel seeds and star anise seed as an important ingredients while you cooking the fish it offsets the negative effect and augments the positive effect next week during the program i will speak to you touch on the aspect of food and how the energy is generated into your body how the food generates into the energy when you consume wrong kind of foods it dilipidates your energy then you do not have energy and you cannot perform efficiently in your day to day functions of life this does not mean that you just choose one item and overlook the other it requires a complete overhaul change of your lifestyle what is needed breakfast in the first thing what are you 
consuming for breakfast does your breakfast include fruits then the proteins because breakfast is one of the most important meals one of the sufi masters my grandfather he always like for his breakfast make the roti in the night and leave it overnight so it gives a very different kind of a texture and then he puts the ghee over it and salt roll it into a roll and eat in the morning so what it is happening the first thing you are consuming a good quality fat either clarified ghee or butter the difference between butter and ghee is butter is has the fat clarified butter which is ghee as well as the water contents when it is heated then the water content evaporates and you get the clarified butter or what we call in our daily language as ghee and he had mentioned because in ancient times the masters were considered to be physicians and according 5000 years ago in china the function of the doctor was to keep you healthy and if he cannot keep you healthy the doctor has to pay the fees to the patient not the vice versa now doctor keeps you coming to him again and again and for that he charges you the money 5000 years ago the doctor has to pay you the money if he cannot keep you healthy so the masters were the doctors and he had mentioned that in the morning eating this leftover roti with smeared with ghee and salt and also the seeds of malkangni which is one of the herbs that helps you in clearing all the heart all the ailments of chest respiratory ailments this document on malkangni and its oil very expensive and it is good for massage when there is weakness in the joints as well as the bones and all these kind of situations so you have to make a complete change in your lifestyle the kind of oil that you use the kind of flour the kind of salts the kind of vegetables does your diet have enough protein and for that very reason you can make a multi grain protein multi grain means you are not just eating the same dal over and over again every day in indian style there is a wide range of dals and it is cooked differently you can mix one or two dals in order to make a combination like for instance in rajasthan there is a particular dal is known as panch mel dal where five different grains of dals are mixed together to make a dal this enriches your protein contents if you decide to use the meat contents then you can decide to choose the fish or egg whereas the other red meats and so they are not suitable for human intestines as far as i'm concerned i do not use any meat products we are also coming to you with the compliments of deep frozen items various types of samosas which has a very soft crispy pastry filled with spiced spinach and paneer which is known as spinach and paneer samosa cheese and jalapeno chili paneer peas and potato mixed vegetable chicken samosa chicken is first marinated and cooked in the clay oven which is tandoor then it is prepared into a small size for the chick samosa filling then it is spiced again according to the samosa filling and then it is cooked 
then various types of parathas the paneer paratha the potato paratha gobi paratha that mixed lachcha paratha lachcha means layered paratha and then home style paratha also we are bringing various sweets carrot halwa moong dal halwa which is cooked with moong dal and clarified butter ghee then the other burfis ras malai all these things are available in totality at prem singh's puja bhavan in kurep and various other supermarkets in the east cost cutters cost price in lower aranguis better deal high low food stores west morings the cascade marawal and few other high lows have got their stocks naipaul extra food price club all the three branches here you can get all these items you can call me at 6838587 for any wholesale inquiry or any information that you need to know about this program about various products or you want me to speak on anything else that you may want to know 6838587 tausho buddha or 7479770 zero anand any of these two people can answer your questions and also since i made the announcement of cooking class there has been a tremendous interest generated but one problem that we are facing we haven't got the confirmation about the venue as yet in case you have any arrangement of any venue any home kitchen where about 10 people can accommodate will be good enough because once we had the cooking class at the residence in lunch park and it was very well organized then you can give me a call at 6838587 tau shobuddha the cooking class will be quite comprehensive is just this week i had made one of the paneer vegetable which is malai paneer firstly Malai paneer is much softer and rich in protein. In order to make this, you require the whole uh, milk, and then when milk is boiling, you add fresh cream to it, so it becomes richer. Then you make the paneer, and this was cooked in pistachio gravy. You remember? Uh, Imagine uh, the paneer cooked in pistachio gravy, tremendously rich and very healthy. so you will know the from appetizers to main course meals and also the sweets that we need to know on a day to day basis the home style cooking where you can cook the same vegetable in a different way with different blend of spices and the our slogan is cooking tau sho buddha way cooking lovingly cooking meditatively because it is the food that you cook and when you put your lovingness into it it becomes healthier and life giving invigorating so we are coming to you with the compliments of surabhi coconut oil and lakshmi coconut oil himalayan rock salt shri gun blend of spices biryani pulao masala samosa masala chaat masala shahi paneer masala butter paneer masala sambar masala and many more range of masalas the deep frozen foods khao to jano we have also in deep fruits the gluten free items which is dosa idli and sambar complete gluten free food for those who are gluten intolerant and then we have other flowers um, multigrain flower and various other flowers that can help you to change your lifestyle we are coming to you with the compliments of tau sho buddha food network 
एट सेवन और सेवन फोर सेवन नाइन सेवन सेवन जीरो दिस इज ताउशो बुद्धा साइनिंग ऑफ फॉर दिस मॉर्निंग्स प्रोग्राम नो योर फूड्स मेक श्योर टू ट्यून इन टू द सेम प्रोग्राम सेम स्टेशन नेक्स्ट वीक एंड कीप योर डायल वेयर इट इज फॉर कंटिन्यूड प्रोग्रामिंग ऑन रेडियो आकाशवाणी वन ओ सिक्स पॉइंट फाइव एफ एम